Hi everyone, and welcome back. This is Road to Slime. My name is Jimmy the Ghost. Um, I have been going off and on lately to um, get you know my wheat going, but it seems that this time around I got raided, which is to be expected. But you know, I did end up <clears throat> excuse me, I did end up getting over my time a little bit of bread to get my hunger back up and I had some apples from cutting down all these trees and I have plenty of wood so I'm not super worried um I will take these torches I think it's time to go it, I really do I've uh yeah I just need to go um I figured I figured I would just do stuff a little bit offline just because or not offline but without recording just because I figured that um I don't know you don't want to see me farming the whole time uh yeah, so that was my reason. So anyway, time for us to continue onward in the this way direction. South, southeast-ish. At this point, I'm just hoping I'm going in the right direction. Because I don't remember anymore. I've been over there for a little bit, so little losing of my way. What is that? What? Reminds me of the dimensional door dimension mod, um... <laughs> dimensional do Anyway, um, dimensional door mod. Like, they have, like, iron doors like that, um, scattered throughout the world. And you can go to these dimensions and stuff. And they could be anywhere, so that... <laughs> that, w that wouldn't surprise me. But this is vanilla, from what I understand. All right. Let's see if we can find our way. We get some seeds on the way, because we don't know what we're gonna run into. We're pro uh, what I'm hoping for is that on the way, I can find shit. I can find a um. What's it called? A uh. Ravine, right? Ravines are great because they're open and you can see the resources and they're quick. Because, uh, I'm really not, at the moment anyway, I'm really not into, um, establishing myself completely. I'm more about trying to travel. And I need armor and stuff if I'm to survive. And, to be honest, at the moment, all I w was worried about at the time was, um, the food situation. And I'm good for now. I figure until I'm, like, running, um, three apples and maybe no bread, and then I'll, you know, set up shop again. But until then, I'm gonna be traveling. We're doing alright here. I wonder, I wonder... Wait, this looks familiar. This looks like a place I was at before. And then there was like a zombie, like right there. <laughs> no, it's not completely the same, but it's similar. Anyway, I'm in a, I am really feel like I'm in a good place right now. Ooh, a lot of water. I wonder if I it would be worthwhile to make a boat. All right. Oh, I didn't bring my crap. I didn't bring any. Oh, whatever. I'm not going to complain. Let's make a couple boats. Three boats. All right. Fantastic. Oh, I'm really glad there was a ledge there, because I am being reckless. Fantastic. This may or may not be proven fruitful at all, but if there is a river... <laughs> worst river ever. Okay, whatever. At least um, I have backups for when I um, do find a large body of water. No big deal. Whoop. Drowning. I hear a zombie. What I really need to stop upgrade my weaponry, because Stone Sword can only take me so far. It can only take me so far. Whoop. Excuse me. Do, 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 do. I wonder how far I've gone already. Oh, like in terms of percentage of how far I have to go. 
that would be interesting to know because, like I said before, Sly Fox flew for an hour to um, wherever, and he didn't have to deal with terrain. He didn't have to anything. And, you know, flying, from what I understand, is basically sprinting, and I'm not running right now. Oh. Don't know what happened there. Don't know if I need my boat or not. But let's try to avoid the water if we can. Speaking of that, I heard that, um, uh, just today, uh, Sly Fox, um, made a, uh, upload a video where he found, um, someone found him. Um, which is kind of cool. But, you know, in the video he said that he wasn't exactly looking for him, so he was just wander wandering, like, wa um, aimlessly. Which makes me think that chances of finding him just in general right now until he gives out the coordinates is going to be freaking impossible. Which makes it interesting. I want to kill that sheep. I could use wool for a bed. So, when I, oh, oh, there's another one. What I'm planning on doing, because I was thinking about this, what I'm going to be doing is uh, all the sheep that I find on my way I'm going to kill, and I'll make a bed with it. And I won't destroy the bed, but I'm going to put them in a place that no one will find it, so I can at least have a spawn there. So if I do die, I can, um, you know, not have to trek all the way back from spawn. Because that would be a nightmare and a half, and I would probably rage quit this series, and I'm just being honest. And I don't want to. I really want to um, stick with this, because I haven't done much of anything in a long while, and I'm happy to get back into it. Oh, somebody's definitely been here. Yep. I wonder if anyone's, like, living here, if I should prepare myself. Yep, someone's living here. Interesting. Do, 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 do anyone home? Hope not. Oh, there's been a kill here recently. Or at least a fall damage. Ow. Let's try to avoid this if we can. If we can. Okay. Do, 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 do. Oh, okay, there's no crops. I was gonna see if I could probably raid it. But, whatever. What on earth is on top of that? What on earth is on top- Is this stone? The f That's clay, what the hell? Whatever. That's <laughs> odd. Why would someone do that? Do, 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 do. More zombies. Great. 